Like, we want to be relatable to all people. Like, regardless of what language they speak in. Like, we're working on multiple projects. One being, um, we have a mixtape that's going to be coming out called Translation. Okay, okay, okay. This is what it is. Um, we're going to feature um, Dominican, Jamaican, American artists all on this mixtape, basically repeating each other's language to each other. Mm. So basically what we're doing, we're using that as a tool to, to teach languages through music. So, 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 so if I'm on the track, I'm just speaking English on one track, am I talking to a Spanish guy on the track? Or are you just going after me on the well, second track? Well, it's gonna verse? be a little bit of both. Okay. Mainly like, uh, in translation meaning, you say what I say, and I say what you say. Oh, okay. If I'm speaking English, you can say the exact same thing I say, but say it after I say it in Spanish, in Spanish. and you connect with a whole different audience. Okay, I see you say okay. And you're also teaching them, because okay. once they get out, they're like, hey, look, man, he just saying the same thing. Right. But it's cool now, you know what I'm saying? Because if we go do a show over in the Dominican or wherever we go, right. and they don't speak you know, English, right. there ain't no problem. Right. We'll just perform our translation mixtape. Oh. We got a Dominican artist right here with us. Okay, I see what you're saying. And everybody gonna know what we're saying that way. If we over there and there's people over there on vacation, they can come to our show too. Okay. With a Dominican crowd. Okay, okay, I got you, I got you. Okay, okay. And everybody, everybody, I mean, how many in the total group? Well, um, the Pandora itself, like, we're just a family. Okay. Um, we're, like, we pretty much enhance people. Okay, um, okay. So we have, we have, you know, we touch artists everywhere. Okay. Um, but in our immediate camp, uh, you know, it's been anywhere from six to 10. Six to 10, yeah. That's all I was saying, like the Wu-Tang. Right, okay. But we pretty much promote every brand. Like we have like different labels mm -hmm. up under the Pandora family. Okay. Um, and each of the guys they'll speak on each individual label. Mm -hmm. But Pandora basically manages pretty much everybody's label. So Pandora's like the tree and the branches right. coming off. Okay. We all want Pandora. Okay, I got you. I got you. Y'all connected to the tree. Right. Okay, I got you. I got you. I got you. Okay. I got so you. Um, got you. everybody from different hoods. Yeah, we from everywhere. Right, right. So ain't no confliction, ain't no confliction in hoods. No, like where I'm from, you know what I'm that. saying? Yeah, uh, like, bad, I mean, bad, like, bad, there's yeah, gonna be friction everywhere you go, uh, you know what I mean? But the people that we're involved with, it ain't no friction. The people yeah, we're gonna cool. touch, if it was friction before we started with them, right. we're gonna stop all that. Right, like, that's right, what this right. is about. Like, we're gonna reach out and connect people who you normally wouldn't see together. Right. Like, right. even in our family alone, the Pandora family, we got people from everywhere. Right. Speaking right. myself, I'm from Roper. Okay, okay. This man from West Tampa, you know, this man from Temple Terrace, you know, yeah. like, we got people from everywhere. Okay, okay. And I got other people from, you know, Lucy who I deal with, you know, I deal with people from Palm River. Okay. People that's not in this state. Okay. You know what I mean? But like when they come together, we come together to work. Right, right, right. right. So, we right. got an upcoming project also that we're gonna be working on. Um, Stop the violence movement. That's dope, um, that's dope. Which that's gonna give each neighborhood a chance. We're gonna go around and get different artists from each neighborhood and feature them on, on a certain project. Okay. Pretty much uh, promote that movie. That's dope. And, 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 and how many, how many, how many major hoods it is in Tampa? You can count like the major ones is really people know. How many I mean, amazing? now it's different. Like um, that when I was growing up, it was just West Tampa, uh, you know what I'm saying? Robles Park, College okay. Hill, uh, Pont de Leon. But now you have like hoods inside of hoods. Uh -huh, okay. And me, myself, I'm like a young OG. Right, you know what right, I'm saying? Right, right. So like, it's kind of weird for me to say, but I don't know a lot of the hoods now. Right, right, like, right. There's a lot of things going on. Right, 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 that, right. You know what I'm saying? I see it going on. I ain't really involved in it. But, you know, when you ask about major hoods, yeah, if I say the wrong thing, it might start some problems. Oh, you know straight so, down. So, but now, like, it is. Like, it's, yeah. it's like hoods inside of hoods now. Just like our group, it's like it's a group, but we, so this was like this is like what is this? This is like what? This is like Temple what? Well, this is like, like Temple Terrace area. Part of like Temple Terrace, right. but you know. So like, if it was a park name, John. If it's a street called Johnson Street, it'd be like the Johnson Street crew or something inside Temple Terrace. Well, I mean, kind of like yeah, that. Yeah, sort of, kind of like over here it's like, called like Cross. Okay, you know what I'm saying? But you can if you on that side, you'll say, oh yeah, we don't fuck with right. Cross. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But. Uh -huh. It's territory everywhere that's just as bad. It's just depending on who you're dealing with and what situation you're running right, into. Okay, okay. But yeah, like major hoods. Back then, it was only, you know, West Talking Tampa. about maybe the history of, uh, you know, our Tampa city. Tony right. Moore opened the door for like Tom and other artists, even before Tom. Like, okay. Tampa Tony would be the guy, you know, rated Speculation on. Speculation on um, Kyra. Where is she from? 
Kaya, 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 where is she from? Who? Kaya, okay, okay, is that, is that, is that that's a shot? Oh, no, I'm talking about a shot at Kaya. I don't know who that is. Oh, you don't know who that is? All right, I don't know who that is. Like the gun, no, the, uh, the Nina, the Nina, Nina, Nina Ross, Nina, Nina Ross. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah she'll probably call herself an OG. She she probably, yeah, yeah, her and Price was like they battled a couple times. Oh, uh, okay, okay. But I think you know we probably more or less accept Price. Price, you know what I'm saying? Shy. Yeah, I mean, yeah, she yeah, she was like she was probably better than you know, like she was kind of buzzing for a while. You know uh -huh. what I'm saying? Like she she make a different kind of moves now. Okay, you know, okay. I believe like okay. she's doing. Things probably like behind the scenes. She rep the city though? Yeah. Yeah, okay, I know okay. she can tell. Okay. I mean there's other female artists that, you know what I'm saying, I probably, you know, may not be speaking on, but I've been away from the music scene for a while. Right. Okay. Um, but those are just the ones that I'm really familiar with and I know that they cause them, you know what I'm saying? They, they got blades right now. Okay. okay. So so if you talk about your um um Pandora and we talk about the whole group collectively and everything, like what is it? What's essentially about the group that kind of like separate really pretty much them from a lot of other competition or a lot of other music that's going on right now? So if Tampa, if I grew up in Tampa and I listen to Tom G, I listen to so and so and so and so, and then I get y'all mixtape, what is like going to be the separation factor? You know what I'm saying? Kind of like in football, you separate yourself from them, get right, the catch. So you feel me? Yeah, I well, really like it's authentic, and this group, you know. It, they want to call it a group, like Pandora family. family. In itself, like, it stretches so far, and you know, they'll start to understand things down the line as we continue to cover our, cover our story. Mm -hmm. That, like, we touch, and we, we have places where people really don't know. Okay. Like, we, we in some situations, and we deal with people that are already in the business. Pro Major, like, he like, he real big in this city. Like, okay. he's really trying to push, 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 push. Yeah. He don't really care who you are. Right, like, right. Like, he's right. willing to help. He spent his money, his time, right. and he for real about it. And he one of the main, like one of the major people that's working behind the scenes. He helping us a whole lot. Okay. okay. He helping a lot of artists around here. Okay. Um, and I mean, people like that is what's gonna push out city group. And that's pretty much what we're gonna stand for too. Okay, okay. Okay, and the last thing I wanna ask is um from being down here and stuff like being able to uh, you know me talking to different artists, what do you think is like the issue with the uh the unity? Like people knowing like we grew up in the same area, we fighting for the kind of the same goal, we all wanna we all in music, but what's really stopping the people to be like, hey, let me jump on your joint, let me jump on your joint. More kinda of like how Atlanta or how New York used to be, how LA used to be, kinda of like what is like the tension in that? I'll speak on my personal belief okay. on that. Okay. Um, I just believe that people don't understand how to be successful. Okay. And they don't understand that it takes more than just you. So here in our city, it's kind of like everybody's fighting for that spot. Mm. But they don't even realize, like, it ain't even a spot yet. Right, right, so right. So in order for us to even create a spot, we got to work together. Right, okay. If we don't work together, then it won't ever be a spot here. Right, right, I got you. So again, that's where Pandora comes in. Okay, okay. Like, we're going to work with different artists, you know what I'm saying, in ways to work. They probably won't even know that they work with together. Mm. Okay. But when it come out, people are here. Right, right. And they're brilliant. Right. You know what I'm saying? Okay. And then people start to take out. So, like, what do you think is the um, like the difference between like the city since they so close together? What do you think, like, because when I talk to people, they be like, "Oh, I ain't from Tampa. I'm from St. Pete." Like, they saying like, "I'm different from them." You so, mean? You mean musically? Or yeah, musically or music? Yeah, yeah. It, it, the conversation is it's about music when they say it. Right. So they may take it like the way I dress, the way I talk, well, my culture. Well, no, again, like it's, it's, it's people not really understanding that we kind of in the same market. Mm -hmm. So like the separation between the two cities is basically like the same people either they better than us. Okay. okay. Which means they don't want no kind of relations or connections at all with Tampa. Oh, that's just crazy. Because Tampa got a so-called bad name and all that. Uh -huh. 